All right, welcome back to Tan and Kuna, level three. We learned that we could do the spin dash thing on the last level, and we learned that we're not very good at this game yet. But it's pretty fun. I bet the puzzles get pretty challenging later. Hopefully I don't get stumped too hard and look like an idiot. <laughs> But I guess we'll see what happens. The loading screens are pretty long. Surprise, surprise. Thank you, Nintendo Switch. And thanks for the Switch Pro not getting any upgrades on the... Um... Specs. It makes a lot of sense if you ask me. Why? Ah! Okay, so... Looks like he has, like, an attack if you press Y, so that's nice to know. Oh, and you can do it in the air, also nice to know. Okay, I feel like I'm going to attack something that I think I can attack, but it'll just send me off the ledge, which is fine. Whatever. Okay, so there was a... A diamond in there. Cool. Ooh, it just got real windy outside. It must have wanted me to go... What is that thing? E? Oh. Okay. So... We can jump... Oh, extra high. Ah, I fell. Let's... Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah! Uh, ooh, ooh, did you see that skill? Oh no, a checkpoint. What if I missed something? I didn't know there were gonna be checkpoints. Well, we learned something new already. There are checkpoints in this game. What was that? Oh, another one of those things. Cool. So, I think I saw the third diamond. Ooh, we need that X thing. We need the, the floaty guy. Oh, camera. Oh, we can jump and travel across these trees. Yeah, that's way too high up still. This kind of reminds me of Sonic, because you get that little dash. I don't know how far this thing goes. Okay, not very far. Oh, so we can get... Oh, it's a ball. I wanted the um, thing that lets you jump. Is there something around the back of that platform? Alright, so if we just push this off for now... Cool. I went up there. Do you think I could get the thing and jump on the platform and get over here before it runs out? I feel like it didn't last long at all. Oh, maybe that's a button I can press? That thing with the little flower on it? This? Ah. It looks like there's platforms or something around back. Oh. There are platforms. Oh! <laughs> Nice! Aren't we just the smartest YouTuber? Awesome! Okay, cool! Now, we can just jump back over here... Uh, ooh! We made it! Wait for this 
floating platform to come back. The depth perception is kind of hard to read. I think it's cute that the little character comes out of its ball when you're waiting. I know this reminds me of something, but I'm not sure what it is. Like some game where you had to push a ball. Kind of like Glover. You had to like push a ball around. You had different kinds of ball, but like a bowling ball and a marble and a glass ball and a bouncy ball and a bowl. I said that. Anyway, you had a bunch of different types of balls. It was really cool. There we go. Level three complete. Probably a bad, bad time, but we completed it, so... Dang, we suck one time, but... That's fine. Level 3 completed! Try out level 4. Loading screens are a bit long. Seems to be the thing on Switch, though. Oop, do we put a secret at the beginning? I don't think so, but... Okay, I thought maybe we could dash into that and it would break. That looks like it'll crumble. Ooh. Can we go in water? We can, okay. Or maybe that's not water, it's like sparkly, cool stuff. this thing do? Ah! You're a bad guy. I can't kill you, I guess. Okay. Good to know. Ah! I wonder if I am just like uh, a passive little ball. But no, oh, I wanted the... Okay. Oh, okay. They come back. Oh, the depth perception is rough. Oh, what's that? Oh, health. Nice. That's the first time I've seen that. I wonder if it counts as not getting hit if you just have full health at the end. Or, you know, you get that bonus thing for the hearts or whatever. I wonder if I just end with full health if you get that, like... I don't think it's a score multiplier. Oh, God! Um. Oh, do I jump on these logs? I made it. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh. Can we do that again? Okay. It seems like you just need to get kind of close to them and they all absorb into you. What are those? Oh, we can break these. Oh, nice. Okay, well, let's go this way now. Checkpoint. Nope. Got him. 
Sorry, I'm not talking much when I go on these little things. I always just assume I'm gonna fall because I kind of sucked at the beginning of the game. <laughs> the first jump kind of got eaten and I thought I was gonna get hurt by the... No, oh, we missed a diamond thing. Oh. I was doing so good about the diamond getting. Wait, what's up there? How do you get up there? Probably where the diamond is, huh? Oh no! Okay. I guess we just have like a couple seconds to move the ball. Okay, we got it. Kind of. Okay, we got it. Oh, whatever. I guess we'll... Maybe I'll come back and complete these 100% later, but... I just kind of want to play through the game, you know? Alright, level 4 complete. And another long cutscene. Level 5. This is a boss or something? Hello? I don't like these cutscenes. They take really long. Come on. Okay, I can see one of the triangle things. Or triangles, what I keep, what's that? What are you, buddy? Um? Okay. <laughs> so it's a tunnel you later. Cool. Anything up here? What can I do about those bad guys? Wonder if we're supposed to go up here yet. Wonder what we do what do we do with these little spears? Oh no! Boom! Boom number two! Oh. Alright, so it wasn't necessary to go up there. Still not sure why I need these purple orb things. But I've just been collecting them because I love collector games. Any hidden things? Doesn't look like it. Let's climb up here and get the remainder of these purplers. Ooh! Oh yeah, we saw that on the, the cutscene at the beginning. In we go. Wee! <laughs> A life thing. Cool. Oh, cool. It doesn't let you pick it up if you haven't lost any life. It's kind of nice. I like when games do that. So, like, if you get hurt and you really want your health back, you can go back to where you didn't pick up health earlier. I mean, you could always do that even if you didn't get hurt. But, um, sometimes you don't get hurt and then you run over a health thing and it lets you pick it up and then it's gone even though it didn't replenish or like give you backup health or anything, you just wasted it. Uh, I could just be speedrunning, like, or not speedrunning, you know, just running through the game, but I feel like this level... We must get up there at a different point. Like, yeah, here's this thing. What is this? Come on. Okay, I think that does launch you some. That's kind of cool. Can I roll over this? I can. Okay. Nice. Okay, so that's the end of the level, so this must not be the end yet. Another life piece. Isn't 
It seems like simple enough. What? Oh, I can turn this really slowly. Really, really slow. Okay, is it gonna stay there? Sure hope so. Can't see. Bad camera. I don't see any diamonds. I don't think I lost any health. Jump down here, grab these purple things, jump over the spikes. Can't turn the camera during this screen. Man, another bad guy. Don't know what I'm supposed to do about them. Okay, I think we've already been down there. It just looks new because it's from a new angle. Go this way. Let's go this way. Okay, this is how you beat the level. So I really don't want to go there yet. Why is that guy stuck there? Let's try going this way. I think I only got one of the diamond things, right? Oh, there's one. The third one. Dang, where did we miss one? It must really be hidden and you have to like... pick every nook and cranny or something. Oh well. We'll come back, maybe, at some point. Wait, did he make it that time? Doesn't look like it. Alright. I guess one question before I end this episode. Do you guys want to see me going back and finding the remaining diamond things? Or do you just want to see how the game ends out? Either way, let me know. Leave a like and subscribe, maybe, if you would like to see more of this, and I'll see you in the next one.